Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Stalker. Not Call of Creep yet, but st Stalker uh, the Lost Alpha. There is a rumor that at the army warehouses one supplier set up shop in a small basement. He doesn't sell much, but at least he has medkits for lower prices and lots of drinks to quench your thirst. This uh, PDA is blinking because of this and something else. What's this? Uh, what are all these? That's map, that's the history. That's all the contacts that are probably in the area. Top 20 stalkers, marked one. 1012. <laughs> uh, marked on relations. That's a lot of relations. No, I want to be friendly with a zombie fight. Zombies, no. Mercenary, enemy. Monolith, enemy. Well, of course. Anomalies and mutants. Okay. <clears throat> Can I trade? He doesn't really have much, so that's too bad. Oh well. Where's the footsteps, though? I'm, I'm confused. Was there no footsteps? In the original? Get off. I guess not. Right, let's go to that area. And unfortunately... We'll have to, uh... We'll have to do with just a pistol for now. But if we're gonna be killing bandits, we're gonna get a lot of free stuff. Anyway. We have so much stamina, look at that. I'm just sprinting through this place. And what a drab and horrible place this is. Horrible, look at it. Oh, those are... <laughs> look at them all sitting, you see on the map, look at them all sitting in a circle, it's pretty good. Hello. There's lots of crap over here. That doesn't really interest me. Ooh, what's going on? Right, there's the guys. Can bear oh, come on, game! What the hell is going on? What? Where are they? Are they below ground? I can hear them. Oh crap! They're below ground, aren't they? Oh, here we go. Okay, I was I was afraid they actually were below ground, and there was no way to get them. They were bugged. But, nope, fortunately, they're just in here. Oh, hello. How do you do? Enjoying the ride? Apparently. Hello, guys. <clears throat> Whoa! Class, proud. Hi. Wolf has already sent word of you. Do you have any questions? Yes, how many bandits are in the camp? Five or six. Most are inside the main complex, but I guess someone is patrolling the north entrance. Shall we say a prayer and go? Uh, yes, round up your men. Well, I'm not saying a prayer. Men, but we can still Wolf go. Wolf sent us some support along with the order to attack. Time to move on and be heroes. Assault the bandits and find the contact. I don't remember, are there any anomalies here? I don't think there are, right? Interesting. Where's my footsteps? Darn it. I hope that's not a bug. Yeah, I wasn't under the impression at first that this game, I mean, this mod, if you want to call it so, was not released yet. But, um... Yeah, it was. It's actually one uh, version 1.3 already. And I'm really interested to see how they've improved it and changed it. <coughs> Are you really using the binoculars from here? What the hell was... What the hell was that? Somebody screamed. Right. Assault the bandits and find the contact. What's over there? To Darkscape. Oh yeah, that's the map change. Unfortunately, the maps are fairly small. Unlike in the third game. Come on. Are we going? Should I just go in? Oh! Cutscene. Ah, we were starting to think you fell in an anomaly, doggy. I am relieved yet disappointed. I'd never give you that kind of pleasure. Anyways, you've got the package? Yes, right here. It makes my blood turn cold, so keep it in its container. You take it to the client as we agreed, and our contact will give you your pay once it all checks out. Any questions? No. Knowing the client, I'll make this short. He's impatient as a raging pit bull. Oh, I wonder what he'd say if he heard that coming out of your mouth. Spare me the details. See you around. What the hell? What the hell? 
Marked one, go, go, go. It's time to kick ass. I'm gonna let them go first. Because this can turn ugly. He's already shot someone. But I don't... Yep, somebody is quite hurt. Where are they? Ah, he's over there. Thank you. Take all. Now we have a shotgun as well. There we go. Where's the rest of them? Yeah, I'm worried that there's no footsteps of mine. Take all, of course. At this point, we need all the stuff we can get. The problem is, I don't know which guys are mine and which guys are not. Hello? I can hear one over here. There he is. Oh! Can I reload? Why can't I reload? I've only shot one once and I can't reload for some reason. There's some ammo over there. Well, that was easy. I thought it was going to be much more difficult. Anyone else? Apparently not. Take all. Uh-oh. Military chopper. I don't want to be outside when that happens. Wait a second. Take the ammo. Oh, you can actually push them around when you walk like this. Oh, I... Didn't, didn't the mod say they introduced ragdolls? I'm not completely sure if they were there in the uh, original or not. That's interesting. Look at that. Nothing to pick up here. Oh, that's cool. You can actually see the... Uh, the rain outside pouring down. So I'm guessing that's it. We should just go and uh, talk to the main guy. He's inside, I believe. Hello? Where are you? Ow. Hello? Are you upstairs? Where the hell is he? Is he there? Oh, hey. Um... I'm confused. Where's the guy? Uh, assault the bandits and find the contact. Is it below the ground then? There's nothing here. It's probably just a body then. If they killed him. As he said him himself. Ah, there's another floor here. Okay, let's go upstairs. I am kind of worried about um, batteries, though. My uh, flashlight is going down. There we go. What's this? Can't take that. There's quite a bit of radiation here. Ugh, that thing. Hello? Take all of that. Ugh, look at him. Oh, I did that thing before. Ugh! Yeah, that thing. Ugh! Horrible thing. Anything else I can take? Not really. So what does it say? Speak with Wolf? That's alright, we'll do that. Oh, we just have to go back. Okay, what did we get? We got quite a lot of stuff. I think I'm gonna use this for now. With this we can sleep, I believe. Sleeping bag. Wait a second, can I do it like this? No. So you always have a pistol. This is three. And I can't have the, uh... I can't have a secondary like a shotgun, unfortunately. Oh well. Ordinary sleeping bag, it won't replace a warm bed and a mother's cuddle, but at least it's impermeable. Okay, what's this? Ah! Batteries. Exactly what you need when your, uh... Flashlight is not shining. 
This wonderful artifact is formed by the anomaly trampoline. The use of the artifact demands the neutralization of deadly radiation. Expensive and rare, this artifact is extremely interesting for scientific expeditions and other research activity in the zone. Um, so how do I... I can't equip any of them yet, can I? Doesn't seem like it might start. It doesn't say what properties this have. it has. Oh well. Anyway, um, let's go downstairs again. Oh, there's another level to this. But that bloody helicopter is around. I don't want to get shot. And if I press F5, nothing seems to happen. And this place, place is full of radiation. Probably should not be here. Nothing over there. Yeah, let's just go. Cool place, but there's nothing here. Go, go, go! The Geiger counter is going crazy. Do we have any... Yeah, radiation is going up! Ow, ow, ow! Yeah, we have quite a bit of radiation now. Lovely. So, let's go. I'll have to remember that number three is the primary weapon. I guess I could uh, change the uh, key bindings, but that's not a problem at the moment. Look at all that. A glowing green. It's pretty cool. Eh. Get over this swamp. Unfortunately, I do not have an anomaly detector, and I don't... I don't think there is one in this game. So we'll have to do with, uh, well, this. Just our eyes. There's the helicopter. Why do they just shoot everyone? We don't want to hurt anyone, we're just stalkers. Leave us alone. Right, let's go back to Wolf. Bring him in this uh, artifact, I think he'll want it. I don't think we'll be able to keep it. Loads of stamina, I love it. There we go. And the entrance... Should be here. Oh, we have to go to Wolf. Okay. I th for a reward, of course. And then we go to uh, the other guy. Hello. The bandits are, uh, at the factory are dead. Great job. Sorry that I, under I underestimated you, mate. Here, take what I promised. Now people will settle in the factory and make sure bandits don't come back to tax us out of art uh, our artifacts anymore. Consider me in debt. Mineral water, anti-radiation, bandages, medkit. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. See you. Can I trade with him? I just got a vodka and water. And it's imported clean water from the Outlands. If you're not an alcoholic, then you will probably like it, even if its taste is stale. It won't reduce radiation, but will restore your stamina, health, and reduce hunger much more than any vodka. Reduces the effects of radiation? Huh. Should be enjoyed in moderation. Okay. Well, I've got no radiation, it goes down. Oh! Isn't it... So that you just keep artifacts here instead of equip? What's this? Ah, a device for detecting anomaly fields and disturbances. Okay, we already have that, it's beeping when it needs to. Needs to be attached to the belt and turned on to operate correctly. This is the cheapest type among all detectors and the range of detection is poor. Do I do it like this? Nope. Once again, someone screamed. In the distance. Hello. Hey. Trade. Oh, he's got a <laughs> you can buy a guitar. A string musical instrument resembling the lute or the violin. But larger with six strings. Used by stalkers all over the zone while sitting around campfires. What's this? From the blues? Ah, harmonica. That's pretty cool. Now look at this. You can actually... Ugh, what happened to your face? Yeah, the... The um, rain is sort of... Um, simulated on surfaces. Right, let's go back to this guy. Mission complete, old man. Brought any goodies? Yep. Your second contact was dead too. I found an artifact and PDA on his body. Ah, come to Papa. The client was getting impatient over the artifact. As for the PDA, well, that's only for my lecherous eyes. Oh, and marked one. When you've got the time, I have something I'd like to discuss with you. 
What was it you wanted to discuss? If you insist on knowing, I have a delicate situation that needs tact. Still interested? What the hell? You, you've asked me to talk to you. Explain, old man. One of my contacts got himself in a pickle. His name is Fox. Maybe you've seen him before. For some reason, these sin bastards have got him hostage. These guys, they look like zombies, but even worse. They talk, eat, drink, and shit in the bushes like your normal guys. But they've got a ferocious glare to them. Spooky stuff, even to veterans. Go there and see what they want. Try not to have a heart attack when you eyeball them. I'll see what I can do about them. Can I uh, trade with you? So he's got fuel. Green metal petrol can. If you run off, out of fuel, a short track to the nearest petrol station with a petrol can may be your only option. What? So there's vehicles now? There weren't any vehicles in the original. Screwdrivers, pincers, screws, grindstone. All you need is a small and compact repair kit. Really? Wait, does this cost... Oh my god, this costs 16,000 rubles? Bloody hell. So how much is this? Let's, uh, let's sell this one. Oh, and uh, whatever you're carrying is uh, marked green. That's rather nice. Because of its high protein... Oh, there shouldn't be an apostrophe here. I know I'm a Nazi grammar. Grammar Nazi. Of its high protein and carbohydrate content, corn has been an important nutritional resource for thousands of years. Today, corn has less starch and is sweeter. A good thing about corn is that frozen and canned corn has about the same nutritional value as fresh corn. If the corn is not cooked shortly after it is purchased, then it should be stored in the refrigerator. Refrigeration helps the corn retain its sugar and vitamin C content. Canned corn can be stored unopened for up to 10 years. Was that from Wikipedia or something? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, uh, let's sell all this. Uh, I don't really need... What? Rat pie. Ugh, full of proteins and fat. This is really juicy stuff. Exactly what a hungry stalker needs. It's cheaper than any other food in the zone because it's made out of rats. However, if you closed your eyes and thought about chicken, you wouldn't know the difference. Canned food from an army warehouse raided by stalkers. The best before period hasn't expired yet. So these are really cheap. And this one is pretty much the same. Probably feeds you more. I'm gonna sell it for now. Uh, loads of... Some machine gun. Okay, I gotta keep that. Pistols. Lots of stuff. I'm gonna keep this, of course, for now. Yeah. Uh, let's trade... So I've got 17, well, almost 1,800. How much is this? Way too uh, expensive, unfortunately. Okay. So. Good hunting, stalker. Thank you. So now you're going to go try to release Fox. That's all the way over there. I'm going to keep this map sort of there. So we have the entire map. This is the map, as you can see. The game map, anyway, the first one. So we have to go all the way over there. I'm still confused about my, uh, footsteps. I don't really understand. Should dot cross here. Oh yeah, like that. Doesn't change anything. That's not a dot cross here. Oh well. Yeah, I'm, I'm rather confused about that. Whoa. Something's going on over there. Probably animals, again. But I can run! Forever! I have a feeling F5 is not actually quick-saving the game, though. So I will have to be careful. That looks pretty cool. Can't really see very far, which is unfortunate. But... Oh well. Oh, there's a pig over there. With glowing eyes. And another one. No, no. They're, they're trying to smell stuff. Let's go. I don't know, do I have a visibility thing here as well on the map? Maybe above it. Ugh, it's one of these things. Ugh. Well, that looks cool. Bloody hell. There's a lot of anomalies over here. But hopefully also an artifact somewhere. We'll try to uh, get it next time. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.